Good afternoon, everybody. JDT Fridays Fan 97 here. And breaking news today that Disney Plus will now add some ESPN in December and all ESPN channels in 2025. According to the court cuttingnews.com. It's it's uh, it reads in May 2023 we learned that Disney was building a standalone ESPN streaming service. This would allow sports fans to subscribe to ESPN without cable TV or live streaming service, giving cord cutters a way to watch ESPN networks for the first time without paying for other channels. Bob Iger Speaking at the Monafed Nasdaq's Media Internet Communications Con and Communications Conference has given us some new dates for when how ESPN will launch the streaming service, and then ultimately, as we mentioned on our earnings call, call last week, that there will be an ESPN tile and there is a Hulu tile on the app. And starting in this December, there will be there will be it will start with I'll call it ESPN Lite, and ultimately we all our so-called flagship product of the full ESPN suite of services launches in 2025. That will be there too, and if you look at at Disney Plus and Hulu and ESPN. You increase engagement to an extraordinary level. This is prob that is probably in terms of all the things we have to do to turn it turn it into a profitable business. It's the first step and first and biggest step. Details about are still thin about the service, but here's what we know. When asked about the future of ESPN as a direct streaming service during the first quarter, during Disney's first quarter 2023 earnings calls, CEO Bob Iger said regarding ESPN and when we might make this shift, if you're, ask, you're asking me, is this shift inevitable? The answer is yes but I'm not going to give you any sense of what that could be, but we have to do it. Ob obviously, at a time, that really makes sense from the front for the bottom line. And we're not just there yet, Iger said. And that's not just about how many subscribers we could get. It's also about what is the pricing power of ESPN, which obviously ties to the menu of sports that 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 they licensed. Not not that that long ago, ESPN chairman Jimmy Pit Pitaro made it clear that ESPN will begin a streaming service, but not just yet. We are going to get to a point where we take our entire network, our flagship programming, and make it available to con direct to consumer. Pitaro said in an interview with Bloomberg. That's a when, not an if. We are, we are only going to do it when it makes sense for our business and for our bottom line. Even though Disney may be looking at 2025 for the release date, it is reported that they are already building a, the service. The project is called Flagship as it as is part of Disney's plan to be ready for the day cable TV comes to an end. Sadly, pricing and other details are still unknown at this time. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this breaking news about this that I that I did. And and please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you won't miss any updates on my channel. So yeah, thanks for watching. Until next time, this is JDT Fridays Fan 97 signing off. Ciao.